Hey YouTube family, I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back once again to our daily hacking news series. You can hit the like button to give a shout out to our team. I know you are not going to hit, but it's my duty to tell you. So anyway, the first news is coming from US. So wedding officiant training company, American Marriage Ministries, which is called AMM. They have said that it is dealing with another data security issue after reporting a breach of sensitive data to the FBI earlier this year. So American Marriage Ministries, which is a non-dominational church based in a settle and train and ordinate people to official wedding. So this, and these teams told the record, a record is basically a news agency. So they told the record it hired a fancy investigator in the December to look into an incident that might have exposed an incomplete list of AMM ministries, names and dates of the but being access onto the internet. Now the, this data which is common, so it's not a big deal. Now next news related to Apple. So Apple has announced a new features of iOS 16 which is called lockdown mode. So this new feature is designed to provide a safer environment and iOS for people at high risk at what Apple refers to as mercenary spyware. So this includes people like uh, journalists and human rights associates advocate who are often targeted by the oppressive regime using malware like NSO group Pegasus spyware. So in short, it is going to provide you the from the spyware like Pegasus. Now next is related drone hacking. So the popular protocol of radio control, which is called RC. So RC uh, aircraft protocol, which is called uh, Express LRS can be hacked in a, only a few steps. So this was still according to a bulletin published last week. So basically the Express LRS is an open source long range radio link for RC applications. RC is basically remote control application such as first person view which is FPV drone and designed to be the best FPV racing link. And it was wrote its author on GitHub. And according to the report the hack utilizes a high optimized over the air packed structure and giving simultaneously range uh, and latency advantages. So the vulnerability in the protocol is uh, tied to the fact some of the information sent over the via over the air packet is linked data that a third party can use to hijack the connection between drone operators and drone. So I guess it will be going to work on DJI as well, the old versions because Chinese and it will be always targeted at first. Now next news is related to APT hackers. So during the route, uh, routine malware sample analysis, researchers from Palo Alto Network Unit 42 uncovered the new malware sample that contained a malicious payload associated with the Red Team exploitation tool, which is called Brute Rattle C4. And this is uh, used in the pen testing industry to simulate an adversarial attack. So threat, threat actors are now moving out from Cobalt Strike and started using the new post exploitation tool Brute Rattle, which is a red teaming tool in the commercial market and which is highly sophisticated and developed to evade the antivirus and endpoint detection and the response detection. So had you ever tried uh, running Brute Rattle C4, which is a threat teaming stuff? So anyway, if you had done, just uh, tell me in the comment. So that's all for today. I hope you found this video helpful. If yes, comment on feedback. You may subscribe because we are bringing hacking news on delivery. So at last, thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. Jai.